G'day guys and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going over my round two tips for this year's AFL season. But before we do that, I'm going to go over how I went in round one. But actually, before I do that, we're going to go over who won the margin comp for last week, which was Sportsnut129 and LJH1145. So a two-way tie for round one's margin comp. They tipped, both of them tipped the Ds by 23. The Ds ended up winning by 26. So those two people... Uh, were the closest. If you would like to win round two's margin comp, then on this video, drop down a team and a margin. Follow uh, these guidelines on the screen now. Yep, so just comment team and a margin for the first game of the round, which is the Dogs and the Blues for round two. But now, we're going to get on to how I went in round one. So in round one, I was able to get to five out of nine tips isn't, well, yeah, I mean, it's average, I mean, it's the hardest round to tip, I reckon, round one, because um, you just don't know what's going to happen, it's the first round of the season, so I'll take five out of nine, but hopefully I can do a bit better this round. Anyway, the games I got wrong, I tipped the Tigers and the Blues got up, I tipped the Saints and the Pies got up, who else? Uh, I got Port Adelaide wrong, my team, I always tip my team, we weren't favourites, and we actually put up an okay effort. I was pretty proud of the boys. It would have been good to get a away win from the position uh, we were in at frequent quarter time when we were leading, um, but unfortunately it weren't to be. But yeah, I thought yeah I thought we did a bit better than what I thought we were going to do. So yeah, proud of the boys. But hopefully we can win our uh, next three games of football and beyond that. But I'm just saying the next three because the next three at the Adelaide Oval. I think we have got the Hawks, the Crows, and then I'm not sure. But I know they're, but they're all at the Adelaide Oval. So, yeah, Sunday's games, I got the two out of three correct. I got the Eagles incorrect. I tipped them at about 20 or 25 fit players. And they managed pretty well against the Suns. It was a pretty close game. And, you know, the Suns in the end won by 27 points, but they kicked away late. It was a pretty close game uh, up until the Suns kicked away late. But, yeah, five out of nine for round one's tips. Now we're going to get on to who I've tipped for this round, round two. Round two, the first game on the Thursday night between the Dogs and the Blues. Remember, this is the margin comp game for this round, so comment down below a team and a margin. But what's my margin going to be? I think it'll be a 10 to 20 point victory, and I'll go in the middle of that, 15 points. And the winner of that game, the Dogs. Oh. I'm not completely sold on the Blues. Obviously, they had a good round one win. If they can win this game, then that's 2-0, and oh, and that is huge. And Maybe I'm a little bit more sold on the Blues. But at the moment, I'll play it safe. I'll go the Dogs. I reckon they'll win by, you know, a comfortable 15 points. The next game, Friday night. Bit of a 50-50 game, but I reckon the Swans will just be too good at the SCG. I know the Cats uh, did pretty well on the weekend against the Bombers. But the Swans could win as well by 20 against the Giants. And I reckon, you know, SCG... Um, yeah, they will just be too strong, the Swans, against the Cats. Now we move on to Saturday's games, and the first one being between uh, the Pies and the Crows. I reckon the Pies will just be too strong in this one, meaning that they'll be 2-0, which is absolutely huge for the Pies. And the next game, yeah, look, Bombers and Lions. Lions, I mean, they didn't do that great. They had a good win by 11 points, but they really, um, you know, turned it on in that fourth quarter where they came to play a little bit more. Um, and yeah, the Bombers were just disappointing. I reckon the Lions will get that one done pretty comfortably. The next game, the Power and the Hawks. Saturday Night Football from Adelaide Oval. Yeah, I reckon we'll get the job done in this one. I tipped us in round one and we didn't get the job done, but hopefully here in round two, we can get the job done over the Hawkers. Next up, we've got the Suns and the Demons at Metricon Stadium. I reckon the Ds will win this in an absolute pumping. Next up, we've got Sunday's games. The first one being between the Kangaroos and the Eagles. This is my upset tip, if you will. Some people might not see this as an upset, but I'm going the Kangas. I've just got a feeling that they'll get the, the victory over the Eagles. The Eagles, obviously, I don't think they're going to have many fit players still. And, yeah, I reckon the Kangaroos will just be too strong. I'll have the Eagles uh, finishing a couple of places higher than, than the Kangaroos come the end of the season. But, yeah, 
Richmond and GWS. This is a real 50-50 game for mine. Am I playing it safe? I don't think I'm playing it safe, but I'm doing the safe option out of the two. Tigers, I reckon, at the MCJ. They'll bounce back from disappointing round one for them. And the last game between the Dockers and the Saints, I reckon the Dockers at home. They should get the job done, shouldn't they? Anyway, guys, that is going to do it for my round two tips. Again, congratulations to the winners of round one's margin comp, which was Sportsnet 129 and LJH1145. If you want to subscribe uh, to those YouTube channels, then feel free to. But that's going to be it from me. I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.